Hey guys, today we're going to be talking about chapter 17 of The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe. Um, so the battle's over, the good guys have won, um, and now we have Edmund, Lucy, Lucy Susan, Susan, and Peter. Um, they have gone to Care Paravel, which remember is the castle, um, and they are now being crowned as kings and queens of Narnia. Um, so Edmund really did get to become the king of Narnia. Uh, but he made up for it, I think. Um, so they do get to become uh, kings and queens of Darnia, and they live there for several long years. It says at the end that they've lived there for so long that even the way that they, they talk, even the way that they speak, um, has been like adjusted to like old timey or like how people in Narnia speak, like very, um, how art thou? Like that. So even their speech has been adjusted. So it's been a very long time for them in Narnia. They've basically grown up um, into adults. So, and then they get together and they decide that they hear rumor of a white stag, uh, which is also prevalent, prevalent in a lot of stories um, as being the sort of um, mythical creature of the woods. Um, it's been all, even used in like modern day stories. Um, even as recent as the Throne of Glass series and Shadow and Bone series. They've also used that, that symbolism of the white deer. Um, so this white deer is said that if you kill it, then it automatically grants you one wish. So they're like, you know what would be great? Let's go hunt down this deer. So they all get together as siblings and they go to try to find this deer. And then as they are hunting it, they find the lamp post from the beginning and they're like what is this random thing um, and they're like oh it kind of brings back a memory of something uh, and so as they walk a little bit further and then just like the transition before so they're walking on snow and then all of a sudden they're walking on wood and then they have branches against them and then all of a sudden it's soft furs and they keep going and they keep going and then all of a sudden they bust through the other side of the wardrobe and they are no longer adults um, they are kids again and the professor is there and they want to know if they will ever be able to get back to Narnia and the professor kind of says Yes, I promise you will go back one day. Once a king or queen of Narnia, you will always be a king or queen of Narnia. Um, so this really sets up for later stories. Um, and we're going to read one together. So I hope that you enjoy that. It is called Prince Caspian, and that is what we will be reading next. Um, but I do hope that you really like this story um, and enjoyed it because it's one of my favorites. It is an absolute classic. Um, and I hope that you got a lot out of it. Thank you.